craziest idea and I hope you guys are with me because I made this mess up the wig, okay? Unfortunately, we're back in my house. The hotel couldn't last forever and I'm so sad about it because I really love having a different background. I hate filming in my living room, but it's what I gotta do. Okay, y'all, so I have another wig. At this point, I have enough wigs to be a different person every day of the week. I'm bringing you another wig from Sam's Beauty and let's just get right into it. So this wig that I'm reviewing today is by Sensational. It's from their Sheer Muse collection. Um, and this is an impress lace parting wig in the style Shayna. Salon inspired cut and color, voluminous styles, lightweight unit, hand tied, the lace parting includes baby hair. And it's supposed to be cutting edge looks for the girl who's not afraid to live on the edge. Okay. Now, without further ado, let's actually look at this unit. So again, we have an ombre into what we call a dark ash blonde. Let's look at this parting situation. That part looks really good, like good to the point where I don't even know if I need to pluck that part. So you have a lace part, and this is a deep part, tracks in the back of course, don't need that. We have one comb in the back, you have two combs on the sides, and then your standard elastic straps. So that is our interior of this cap. Let's just go ahead and put this on. Where my wig cap at? Can't put on a wig without a wig cap. Okay, so automatically these combs on the side are kind of weird and they're not very comfortable at all. Okay, yeah, no, we're not gonna use those. So this is what we look like so far. Already I'm getting some shedding. So I haven't plucked anything or did anything like that and I already have multiple strands coming out. So that is my first observation, but let me go ahead and show y'all what the wig actually looks like on me. So this is where the wig is hitting me. back I'm not sure how I feel right now so I think I need to acclimate to this a little bit more let me go ahead and finesse this part situation and I need to look in the mirror because yeah Hello, editing Jayla here and at this point I need to explain to you that I was rambling about color theory and the fact that ash tones are cooler tones and that I had on warm tone jewelry and I had on a warm tone shirt and it just wasn't meshing so I changed my jewelry I changed into silver jewelry which is considered cool tone and I changed it to a blue cool tone shirt so that everything could tie together okay hopefully that makes sense but that's what I'm talking about okay bye. and there the only thing that I've done is add concealer to the part, but I'm still not completely satisfied with this parting situation. I had the craziest idea, and I hope you guys are with me because I made this mess up the wig. Okay, so believe it or not, I am going to attempt to cut a bang in this wig. Mind you, I've never cut a bang before in my entire life. Okay, so section out some hair in the front of my face and I'm going to do this action. Should I just like cut? Should I cut upward? Yeah, let's cut upward. Let's pretend like we know what we're doing. So this is what we have so far. I want to film a thing, so let's go shorter. <laughs> ah! Got shed hair in my eye. This side looks a hot mess. This side looks kind of fire. So right about now, I'm looking like Beyonce, like B-Day vibes. Okay. Um. <laughs> Let me go plug in a flat iron and do something with this and I'll come back to y'all hopefully not looking a hot mess. Welcome back. So, 
obviously we went ham with this wig. We definitely transformed this wig. I have hair everywhere, y'all. I have hair in my eyeballs. I have hair all over my face, on my lips, on my chest, on my clothes. I have hair everywhere. So if you see random bits of hair, I'm sorry. I can honestly say that I wasn't completely sold on how the wig comes. Like the wig as is was okay. Definitely something different for me. So pros, I would say the color. I definitely love the ash blonde color, even though it's new to me. Another pro is that this hair is heat resistant. I did put heat to these bangs to get that curl effect and it took heat beautifully. I had the heat on 370 degrees Fahrenheit and this hair can take up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. Cons, first con is that this wig sheds. This wig definitely sheds, which is surprising to me because I did try another wig from the Sensational Empress line and I had little to no shedding at all. Another thing that I don't like about this wig is that the fact, the fact that the combs are on the sides and it really puts a lot of tension on your head. That's all I have to say about this wig. Thank you so much to Sam's Beauty for sending me over this wig and trusting me with these wigs. I hope you guys really enjoy like me playing around, showing you my mess up, showing you when I overplug, showing you when I decide to cut, showing you when I'm not so happy with the wigs. I really hope you enjoy seeing that. If you do, do not forget to subscribe to my channel, y'all. We are on a journey to 10K. We're gonna hit 10K by the end of the year. I just know it, so go ahead and help me along with that journey. Don't forget to like this video so that YouTube can share with other people. Please like, I bled for y'all. But thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. If you love this wig, you will definitely love my last video in which I review a sister of this wig. I have an entire playlist filled with synthetic wigs that you'll also love. I'll leave it right here. All right, my mama outside and I need to clean up all this hair that I have all around this house. So I have to go. Goodbye.